Let's see if this will even run. All right, I think we're just, oh, that smells like it's burning already. Oh yeah, this might not even survive the video. So let's get to it before this battery dies because this is an old school NICAD battery and they suck. Alrighty, so today what we are gonna do is we are gonna take a trip down memory lane and actually do a versus video against a 12 volt DeWalt old school really old school against the 12 volt DeWalt drill driver that is the latest version and brushless. All right, so just so you guys know, DeWalt is coming out with a brand new five amp hour battery and a brand new impact wrench that actually looks sort of like the Atomic. Uh, here's the picture of it right now and it also comes with a sleeve. So I will be getting that as soon as it's available. I'm excited about that one. And so, but today's video is going to be about these two. Now, I have the battery. The battery's on charge right now because I want this to be uh, the maximum charge it could be. It says it's fully charged, but I'm pretty sure if I take it off charge now, it will actually die out pretty quickly. So, I do not know on how this is going to work. Uh, the, I have a feeling that this battery is going to do a few things than just flat out die. 12 volt tools are my favorite thing. I just realized I haven't done a 12 volt tool uh, video in a long time. And so I think it's time. I love the design of this DeWalt. This is model number DCD701. Uh, and it's a very compact and extremely lightweight. But everyone was saying that DeWalt needs to make uh, bigger, higher amp hour batteries for their 12 volt extreme system. And they did. So a five amp hour battery is on its way. I cannot wait. All right, so let's go over the specs of these and do a little versus video. And I have a feeling that this is going to just absolutely get crushed. Alrighty, so this is model number DW927, 3 8 inch plastic chuck. This has 17 point clutch plus one. The plus one is drill. Uh, this goes to uh, two speed settings. First speed, zero to 400 RPM, and on speed two, zero to 1400 RPM. Now these are regular drill drivers. They are not hammer drills. All right, for the latest one, this is uh, the uh, DeWalt 12 volt extreme subcompact series. It's a brushless motor. I love the design of this. I love how compact this is and the, and the lightweight. This is model number DCD701, 3 8 inch uh, plastic chuck, which I wish this was a half inch. If they made this half inch, it would be so much better. All right, all chucks are metal on the inside, but the housing is plastic. And this goes two speed settings. This goes to 0 to 425 RPM on speed 1 and 0 to 1500 RPM on speed 2. And that is 100 RPMs more than the old school. But the motors are completely different, so I think this is actually going to crap. I think that's going to crap out. All right, so this has a 15-point clutch plus 1, which the plus 1 is drill. And that's the one uh, we're just going to use drill in this video. And so, yeah. The battery is full on the three amp, we're using the three amp hour battery. The battery is full, so let's get to it. Alrighty, so what we're gonna do in this episode, because I have a feeling that this won't even survive, we're only gonna do one test. We are gonna do uh, three timber locks each. We are using Hilti nut setter bits. Now, if this survives the test, uh, we will do one more. I might have to charge the battery up. Oh, this is not a keyless truck. You'd have to hold the grip and then tighten it old school. All right, we got speed. Speed two. Oh, that motor smells like crap. All right, so let's do the old school first. Right here is good. I'll be amazed if, if it could even do it. I'll be amazed right here all right so ready go this is speed two that battery might actually died go to speed one yep speed one is required all right let's do one more on speed one because speed one is going to be required all right ready Go. Who knows, it might be required for uh, the uh, other one too. 
Uh oh. You can do it. You can do it. Time. Let's do one more. Remember, it needs to take him out still. You know what? That's it. We're, we're just going to take it out. We'll, we'll do two. I, I, I want this battery to at least do this. Ready? Go. How we got by back in the 90s is beyond me. Time. Wow. All right, so now <laughs> let's do the new version. Try speed two, it's on drill. Right here is good. All right, so ready, go. It's one. But let's see if this if this could take these out. Ready? Go. Ready? Go. Time. Last one. Ready? Go. Nope, not yet. There we go. Nope, battery died. All right, let's take the last one out with this. Time. Technology nowadays is so much better than what it used to be. Like, I love this uh, drill driver. I really do. Look at that design. It's seriously a fantastic design. But yeah, but here, this is just a simple video so you can see what the difference is between back that way back then and today's uh, tools. Is there a year on this thing? So that's pretty much it, you guys. I do recommend 12 volt tools. I love 12 volt tools. Like th this, I love this design. The design of this is actually extremely awesome. And I cannot wait for the new impact wrench that is coming up for DeWalt with the five amp hour battery. All right, so please tune in for that. If you found this video helpful and entertaining, please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.